Hey everyone, let's try to understand sales analysis. Here we are we are having two table. One is product table and another one is sales table. In product table, we are having three column: product ID, product name, and unit price. Where the product ID is the primary key of this uh, this table. In the sales, we are having multiple columns, and it has it doesn't have any primary key. it means we can have repeated repeated rows okay and what we need to find we need to write a sql query that reports the best seller by total sales price if there is a tie report them all so we can have multiple sell, seller who uh, who must have uh, sold uh, the sold uh, the same amount of price right so uh, what we need to find as we know as we know that we do we can have the repeated row uh, rows the first our first goal will be to sum up the price and uh, after doing the group by on seller id right that will give us the so total sales let's look to look to example itself let's suppose for this sales table we are having seller id 1 and seller id 1 has sold uh, a price of 2000 and 800 so total sales uh sales of seller id 1 is 2800 likewise for seller id 2 it is 800 and likewise for seller id 3 it is uh, 2800 okay then seller id 1 and 3 both are best seller because they have uh, sold uh, product with the most total most total price of 2800 right so we can uh, we can just Uh, divide the solutions uh, by by breaking our uh, by breaking uh, the statement itself the first aim of our will be to cre uh, to find the total sales after grouping after grouping the uh, grouping on seller id once that is done then we can definitely apply dense rank function uh, with respect to total uh, sales price and then we need to filter out then we will filter out um all those rows which are having row uh, rank column as one okay i hope it is making sense to you let's try to write the code and we will try to understand uh, uh, while writing the code okay so let me just first create one group table i will call group table itself i am using with query to create uh, intermediate table and let's try to write our query select seller id our first goal is to find total sales per seller id right then we can have sum of price as total sales cool from sales and what we need to do we need to group by on seller id cool this will give us uh total uh, total um, total sales of each seller right now we need to find the rank right then we will create one rank table as select seller id sorry dense rank what will be the condition here we we will be doing over by or sorry order by order by total sales and it will be descending right i will call this column as rank column let's try to reformat it little bit okay from group table in last what we need to do we need to filter it out right select seller id from rank table where rank column is equal to 1 right we will just run it and check what is our end result
I hope it is running fine. Let's try to submit it. Okay. So this is uh, one of the way to solve this problem. Just one minute. We could have also instead of creating two intermediary table, we could have solved uh, by using simple table itself by creating one temporary table itself or total uh, uh, single intermediary table. How we could have no, how we could have done it? So here in dense rank functions, if we instead of supplying total sales, if we supply like this sum of price, right? and group by seller id we don't need this table this group table done okay if we go by this approach also it is not that much intuitive intuitive but we can definitely do it right we can group by on seller id and in the windows function that is in the dense rank we can use sum of price. Let's try to run it. I think it will run. Uh, sorry, uh, from group table, we need to get from sales table, right? Let's try to submit it. Perfect. I think uh, you are able to get this uh, solution. I will be also writing one LinkedIn article uh, for this all this question. You can follow that LinkedIn article. I will uh, I will pass that link of that LinkedIn article in the description box of this video. Uh, I think you are able to learn from it. If you have learned something from it, please like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Thank you very much.